enough. unique species brothers and sisters we are not bred we are not born we come to life when we accept the gift of change our powers are many and they have served us well the art of glamour has given us safety through secrecy but i am afraid we are becoming the victims of progress sooner or later Human technology will find a way to see past our illusions. They will expose and demonize us and make us their ultimate enemy. Inevitably, we will become their inferiors. Jesus, it's huge. When did they build this? And how? Ah! <laughs> 
Let's crash their little party. We consider ourselves proud hunters, predators. But that pride sometimes prevents us from growing as a species. Internal divisions have weakened us. Our numbers dwindle while their numbers grow. But it's not too late. We can still survive. But to do so, we must be ready to adapt. We cannot be too proud to evolve. of reason. There is a thin line between being a survivor and being a coward. Enough. Your lines thirst for all out war with the humans endangers us all. Peace of Navarro. Without the shield. The wolves go hungry. Yes. The day is coming when the sheep will outwit the wolves. Haven't you been watching, brother? The humans have harnessed the power of steam and lightning, and they grow mighty. If our hubris allows us to grow fat and lazy in the shadows, they will soon have the power to hunt us down like dogs. And so, we propose war. War suggests there is a chance we might lose. I propose we strike. With my new asset, we can control the change. Reclaim the Sanguasuja's rightful place at the top of the food chain. Control the change. Are you mad? 
Even suggesting such a thing is blasphemy. Dominic, brother, these are blasphemous times. While my methods may very well be at variance with our tradition, I can tell you one thing. If we don't adapt, we will perish. Enough. I will not allow even your bastard greed to, to lead us into annihilation. Peter Davala, for the high crime of conspiracy against your own kind, I sentence you and your line to the true death. I told you, Father. They wouldn't listen. We had to try, Felicity Mikara. Our work will be a lot easier if we can help them understand. If we can't... Then we... FORCE THEM TO! Think you could have brought a bigger knife? Some people get a gold watch when they retire. I got Susan here. <laughs> Should have asked him how to get out of here. Too late. He won't be of any use for a month or two. Wait. What about Chester? 
What are you going to do? Now that is how you shape an explosion. Damn, we're late. At least we won't be going back to the manor empty-handed.